Hey, welcome to 19 Online Games. My name is Jan and today I want to show you the progress of Virus Online. That's a game I'm currently working on. And no, it's not about a virus like COVID-19 or something. No, no, no. It's about a computer virus. So, yeah, I started all of this before uh, the whole thing with COVID-19. So, yeah, I guess bad timing. But doesn't matter. But before we get started, I have some great news, you know, it's really great. And this is all about my first release of a game, Blub Want Stars, is the name of the game, it's a really, really small game uh, for mobile. And here you can see the game, Blub Want Stars. You play as this little blub and, well, <laughs> you have to collect the stars because Bloop want the stars, you know, really bad. And that's it, you know, you play as this little guy with this round eye. I mean, eyes are normally not that round, you know. And after you have collect a certain amount of stars, the level is getting harder. But that's really all you have to do in the game. And you can play as one of six characters, you can unlock five more than that one and the same is with the environment. You can unlock five different environments. And if you want to check it out, it is available on the Google Play Store. But now let's go on and see what Virus 9 did this time. First thing I can say is that we now have 11 levels. The level 11 is not finished right now, but yeah. <laughs> Here you see it, um, in the inspector, it is, well, yeah, it's, it's not ready, I'm missing some, some, let's say, decoration and so on, but that turns out really good. And one new feature in, the, in this level is the change of the gravity, and I think I will do it in most other levels too, so from level 11 on because I really like this, uh, this me mechanic. And yeah, here you see the level in-game and a new enemy that is just sitting there and shooting at you. So it is not shooting at you, it is shooting in a certain direction, but it is not aiming at you or something. But So it's pretty, pretty easy to go around the bullets and next we have a section where we will have some voice lines for the story and so on so it's pretty empty right now so there will just be decoration and so on and some more jumping segments with some enemies and so on so it's this, this section of the whole level is not finished right now so i really need to think more about it about the level design it's pretty boring but it will it will be it will be so it is really in progression right now the level it's really not done <laughs> uh, but that's not too bad i have time for this level and i have now some great music made by my cousin and I will just shut up for a moment and let you listen to the music and you can just see the level. Just see the level go on and on. So that was a little preview of the soundtrack and here we have the first level again and I changed the style with the grid system and so on, you see that? And I would like to know which one you prefer. This is the first level, it is, yeah, pretty easy. You have these big boxes and these platforms are little, this is, they are not boxes, you have boxes at all but not boxes at the platforms, you know. 
and here at the second level pretty much the same a little bit more detail maybe that's better i th prefer that one that's a little bit more and here you have even more minimalistic steel <laughs> Uh, I don't like it that much because it's too, I think it's too, it looks too easy, you know. Um, and this style in the, I don't know, fourth level or something is really nice too, I think. It is not the grid system, it is with big boxes and put together everything. And I like it pretty much. I don't know, I like everything pretty much because if I wouldn't like it, I wouldn't have done it like this, you know. And I think this one is my most, uh, that what I m like the most. And after that I have done something with the background. I have put big stuff in the background to have this parallax effect. You have often in the 2D games. And since it's a 2.5D game I thought it will give the whole thing more dimension. And here we have some boxes in the foreground. I don't know if it will confuse the player or not. Maybe you can tell me in the comments if it is better like this or not as good, you know. And then we come to the grid system and the more, you know, more complex materials. I think I like them. Well, <laughs> I don't really know. I think I like them, but they are. It's a pretty different kind of style, a pretty different kind of feeling. And I think the feeling is more tacky, more like this feeling that I wanted to have at the beginning. But it is not that minimalistic style that I really like, that feels good for me. So I feel like the more minimalistic style is better, but maybe you can tell me what you prefer and why you prefer it i don't know just just please tell me <laughs> if this is all shit or not <laughs> yeah that would be pretty great and pretty helpful and that's the progress i did from the last video on and the next video i think i could show you a little bit more because now i have more time for virus online again because i want to finish the game in the end of the year so i have really to hurry up a little bit but so I don't know how to manage all of this perfectly, I will see, but hopefully in the end of the year there will be a game with a good quality, like I wanted it to be, and that's the goal. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't, and if you liked the video please give me a like, <laughs> and don't forget my little mobile game, maybe play it a little bit like it's a little bit like bion, bion, bion. it's a nice game it's fun <laughs> it's a small game yeah you know really really small game but but i like it it's a nice game you know <laughs> so bye bye